Hey everyone and thank you for dropping by today and we'll be attempting to do a firmware upgrade on a Panasonic Blu-ray uh, player and uh, the model here is DMP-BD45 so what I'm doing here at the moment is just to show you what's uh, not occurring so I've inserted a Blu-ray DVD uh, which is Logan, the film Logan, starring Hugh Jackman. And the problem is that the player is not reading it, not reading the disc at all. So you can see not much is happening on the screen. It's constantly showing the read on the uh, display. You can hear it struggling and nothing much is going on. And now it says stop and no read and up on the screen it tells you that it cannot read the disc so this is not the same for all blu-ray uh, uh, discs it uh, will actually play some blu-ray discs so we'll, we'll uh, just demonstrate here I've put in the Tron uh, legacy uh, blu-ray disc um, it still takes a little bit of time to read the disc before it loads it up fully but um, it should work. Still reading. You can hear it. This um, Blu-ray player is approximately, I'd say it's about, I'm gonna say about eight to 10 years old. And there's me in this reflection. Hello, I'm recording. Hi. So now the disc is starting to play. And the good old Walt Disney Studios. And we have the menu. Just click OK for English. And it's reading the disc again. Sounds coming through nicely. Magic in high definition. Always going well so far. We'll skip the previews. Reading again. And then we have the main menu. As a side note, if you've not seen Tron Legacy, I would thoroughly recommend it. Um, the visual effects and the graphics, uh, they're totally out of this world. I mean, you've got to watch it. If you don't agree, I will fight you. So yeah, you can see this disc is working how it should. And also it's a great soundtrack as well um, by Daft Punk. Check it out. So enough of that, let's do the firmware upgrade. So I went onto the Panasonic's website and I downloaded the firmware and I installed it on a blank um, disk. And all you need to do is put the disk in and let the DVD player do its uh, work. So here it's saying there's no update, which is shit. 
So we'll try another disc, so I actually burnt two. And let's see what happens this time. And I'm going to tell you now anyway that it's going to fail again. Um, it says it cannot update the firmware. The version installed is already the version. Sorry, the version already available is already installed. So this was a total waste of time. So what do I do? I don't know. The DVD player still works, so I could still use it for DVD playing, but really, it's really fit for recycling. So it's a shame, but what's the point in having a Blu-ray player when it's going to be hit or miss when if you actually play a disc or not? So anyway, thanks for watching, and uh, stay tuned. There'll be some more videos coming soon on more interesting things than this. Take care now. Bye.